the devil's tacos. That's what we're going to eat today. <laughs> the trendiest foods in America. We try them so you don't have to. It's Taste Test Tuesday. Get in my belly. Come on. Producer Party is in charge of Taste Test Tuesday. What on earth is this? Yeah, so we've been trying to get our hands on these. and We had some troubles, but we got these spicy, tiny tacos from Jack in the Box. They are red and... <laughs> <laughs> they smell funny to me. <laughs> Joy said she liked the smell, but they remind me of like school lunches. Well, I'm allergic to gluten and these are clearly corn tacos. So I really like that. It smelled like I could eat it. But as soon as producer party opened up that little jar, he just goes, ew, gross. Yeah. I mean, look how red not, those are. It's not a good sign. It's like this most, the most artificial looking thing. He does say they smell fake. Um, they yeah. do look like something you can make with Play-Doh. So. We'll yeah. let you know if these if they actually taste good, what a miracle it would be. So can you tell me anything about this? Is is the, the shell what's spicy or is it supposed to be what's inside? You know, that's a good question that I don't know the answer to. Producer party. <laughs> I, know. I kinda I was in such a rush to get these <laughs> that uh I don't really know. I just know that they're spicy. They already have a tiny Do not taco. break it open and look inside. Oh really? It looks disgusting. Should we show them though? Oh, just you to... don't wanna. It looks I don't wanna say what it looks. It looks like refried meats. I don't well, wanna... I think that answers our question though. Look at some of the stuff in it. there. There's peppers and stuff, which That's means disgusting. that disgusting. I bet both are spicy, the inside and the shell. I don't want to eat it now that I looked at it, but I guess we have no we choice. Have to. This is Taste Test Tuesday. We do it for you. Yes. All right. Um, the lady gave me a bunch of sauces for us. Okay. The one that she suggested the most is the creamy avocado lime sauce. For sure going to be wearing this. I spill everything on myself. <laughs> okay. Well, let's try it without first. Okay. All right. We're going to take a taste. Listen, if you would eat this, I need you to comment right now with your bravery. All right. Here we go, party. Spicy tiny tacos from Jack in the Box. It tastes like refried beans inside. Do you know if there's any meat in there? There better be. It's not bad, but... It reminds me of... Whoa, it is spicy, though. It reminds me of, like, school Mexican food. It's getting really spicy. It is getting very spicy very fast. I can't handle spicy stuff. And with the first bite, I was like, I'm fine. And now I'm like, I'm gonna cry. Cool, we brought cool, cool. water. For this very reason. This is why he's the best. All right. I would say the crunchiness is good. If you like spicy, it's good. But I wish there was like chicken or something substantial in there. I yeah. think it's just like beans. Yeah, it's it's very hot, very fast. But the crunch is nice. You were this right. This tastes like something the Taco Bell would have put out. It's very mm. hot. All right, we're going to try. Let's try the recommended sauce. Creamy lime avocado. Creamy avocado lime sauce. Also, um, stick around because in one second, Party has a really funny story to tell you about how he was picking these up that I'm about to put him on front <laughs> yeah, street sure. about. Okay, let's try this sauce. Let's do it. Mmm. I'm about that sauce. That makes a difference. That is very good because the sauce like chills it out. The sauce does taste um, manufactured in a factory. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like the avocado in it isn't like super it, it tastes genuine. Fake. It definitely tastes fake, <laughs> but it covers up the spiciness of the taco yeah. a little bit to where it's a little bit more bearable. It's a poser, but it's pretty good. I like a I like a lime. Anything with ranch in it. Mm. Mm -hmm. I think I might change my opinion based on that sauce. What do you think, party? Is this a thumbs up or a thumbs down? Well, they definitely want you to try it with sauce. That's why they give you sauces. With the sauce... It's a lot more bearable. It's good with the ranch, too. Yeah. So I would give it a thumbs up if you take it with sauce. I'm going to try it with ranch. Are you doing it with yeah. ranch? Yeah. I'm really liking it with the ranch. If you like really spicy stuff and you want to, like, eat it late at night, I think this would be great. Jack in the Box is, like, known. We've actually never tried them before. Hit the like button the if, you're a, if you're a Jack in the Box fan. I want to know. I never eat there. I was going to say, this might be my first yeah. Jack in the Box ever. Yeah. With the ranch, I think it's actually pretty good. Okay. Are you ready to make your ruling? You're a big ranch fan. <laughs> I'm but I, it is good though. With I'm ranch. giving my thumbs up to the ranch. I'm gonna give a thumbs down to these overall, but with the sauces, it could be a thumbs up. What is your thought? So, that's a very confusing ruling. I think I agree with your ruling. It's it's good to note that these were three dollars and fifty cents for that's all of this. It. That's it. That's pretty good price. So not a bad amount to try it out for yourself. It's definitely not like peak fast food, but it's up there. I mean. But now that I started, I can't stop. Yeah, I think they're going to be a little bit addicting. I might finish these, but so I usually th do. Thumbs up or thumbs down? Yeah, yeah, thumbs up. Thumbs up. All right, now 
for the post after show story party party tell them about what happened yeah when you went to pick these tacos up so when i ordered these you know those whole like pay it forward trains that can the start drive up through the drive through stuff that way fm promotes so with these only being three dollars and fifty cents i meant to get in and out pretty quick and when i get to the window they're like they're like hey the person in front of you paid for yours and all they request is for you to pay it forward and i was like Oh no. But here's the hard part because this is like Party Hardy doesn't have to buy all of this food. No. We like get reimbursed for it because it's for the show. Right. So he didn't think he was allowed. Yeah. So <laughs> you were like, awkwardly, Listen, I was like, I hate how? these people. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, awkwardly, I was like, how much did the person behind me pay? And what was your like, limit going to be? I was thinking like $7 would be my limit. Okay, that's pretty generous. Because I was like, that's $4 above what yeah. these were pretty much. It ended up being only $5. And so I, I, I did pay it. He forward. did it. You did pay it. Forward. And I don't even know if I'll be able to be reimbursed for, for that. But that's <laughs> how okay. generous. Listen, he paid for someone else's meal with the company's <laughs> money. Thank yeah. you, party. Very well done. <laughs>